What is up everybody, welcome back to the Maths Guide. Today we're looking at how to find out the surface area of a cylinder. Let's go. Okay, so first of all, what does surface area mean? Well, the surface area is the 2D measurement which measures the entire area of the skin or the wrap around this 3D shape. So you can see here we have our 3D cylinder but over here on the right, this is our 2D net of this 3D cylinder. We're measuring that two-dimensional flat area. One way of looking at it is, how much area would this shape take up on a surface? We can see that we're going to have to measure all of this internal space. And a cylinder is a 3D shape with a top and base, which are circles, and a rectangle that's wrapped around it, forming the cylinder shape. And we're going to look at two formulas today. This one on the right, this is our official formula, but this on the left explains what we're doing. And essentially, to get the total surface area, we're going to measure 2 times the area of the base, because we've actually got, if you think about it, a top and a bottom. So we'll measure two of them, and then we'll add that to the one rectangle. And that's quite obvious when we look over here at our net. We have the top and the base, and then we have the one rectangle as well. Now let's look at the official formula. And the official formula says 2 pi r squared plus 2 pi r times h. So let's break this down. Well, the pi r squared that we can see here, that is the formula to work out the area of a circle. And the 2 refers to the fact that we have two circles. And then we're adding it to 2 pi r times the height. OK, well, let's break that down then. 2 pi r, that's the formula to work out the circumference of a circle. So what we're going to get with that is this black line going around this circle. And if you think about it, that black line is actually the same as one of the lengths of the rectangle. And then when we multiply that by h, the height, we will get the area of the rectangle. So let's jump into it and let's look at that with this example. And I'm actually going to use the official formula. So we have 2 pi r squared plus 2 pi r h. Now let's start to input some data that we know. So we know that the radius of this circle is 2 centimeters. So I'm going to have 2 pi times 2 squared. And this will be the area of the two circles. So let's do those first. And if you haven't seen my video on how to calculate the area of a circle, maybe you should go and watch that first because I'm going to skim through this pretty quickly. But essentially, we're going to start with my power of, and I'm going to do 2 squared first. And 2 squared is obviously 4. So now I have 2 pi 4. Now I'm going to do my pi 4. So I have pi, which is essentially 3.141. But I've got a calculator, so I've got pi times 4 equals 12.57 multiplied by the 2 equals 25.13. So the area of both of my circles, which are the top and the base, equals 25.13 centimeters squared. But now I'm going to add that to the area of my rectangle. So now I'm going to be looking at 2 pi r times h. So let's start by working out the length of this edge here which is the 2 pi r part, finding the circumference of this circle, which as we said is the same as that side of the rectangle. So 2 pi r would be 2 times pi times 2 again for the radius, and that gives me an answer of 12.57. But then I'm going to multiply that by the height to get the area. So 12.57 times the height, which in this case is 5 centimeters, gives me an answer of 62 0.83 centimeters squared. Great, so now I have the area of my two circles, the top and the base, and the area of my rectangle. All I need to do now is add the two together to get my total. So 25.13 add 62.83, and the answer is 170.13 centimeters squared. And there's my final answer. Okay, your turn. Work out the total surface area of this cylinder. Press pause on the video now. Good luck. And there you go. Hopefully this video was helpful for you. If it was, think about sharing it with somebody else that you think would benefit from it. And think about subscribing to the channel. But for now,
Peace out.